So, Dr. Ekechi, he, um, the president did say that he wanted an all-inclusive government. He wants the judiciary, the legislature to all key into his government, and he's was looking towards accountability at all levels. Okay. Yeah, yeah, that, that is consistent with who he is. Uh, that is also consistent with the APC policy, uh, government of inclusion, not government of uh, exclusion. After all, he had become the president not of members of APC, not of members of those who voted for him. He is now the president of all Nigerians. And for you to succeed in this responsibility, you need the cooperation of every Nigerian, including those who were here in you know, opposition, who may differ in tongues, who may differ in tribes, who may also differ in a political leaning, but who have one common objective. We have one common thing that unites us together. That is the future of Nigeria, the unity of Nigeria. That is the betterment of you and the betterment of I. So he has no choice. Now, you know, President Buhari is coming at a time where Nigeria is being saddled with huge economic problems, trying to define, you know, what is going to happen in the petroleum sector. And he said these tasks are, they might be difficult, but they're not daunting. Yeah, they're not daunting. And like we say, a journey of 1,000 kilometers starts with taking up one step. That one step has been taken today. And just not an ordinary step, it's a bold step that has been taken today. And for a man who has been tested and who has been tried before, I think we should trust him. Who, he has seen it all. And for him to have come back to become the president of the of Nigeria, the motive and the objective that he had told Nigeria, he is not afraid, that's what I'm trying to say. And if you look at Nigeria, Nigeria is endowed with enormous resources. No amount of problems we have in Nigeria is such that should pull us down. The important thing is being able to harness the resources, deploy them effectively without leakages for the use of Nigerians. This is a promise. And the one who are doing that is talking of corruption. He is indeed, and as you know, Mr. Corruption. With this commitment of fighting corruption, Nigeria will even have surplus because all the leakages will have been flushed. Thank you very, very much, Dr. Thank you very much.